right, just a quick general update, and actually, ah, not a general update. Let's go ahead and look at the pumpkin. So, here's the issue. And I've talked about this in past years. There's good problems and bad problems. Here's a good problem. We're growing so much forward. It's a longer shaped fruit. You can see it is kinking our vine a lot. I have probably screwed to this fruit back no less than 10 times already. Generally, when it's this size, I've only scooted it back a couple of times, but this one, it just wants to grow forward. It's a fruit, you like to say. It grows forward, back, side to side. It grows in every single direction, so it's something you gotta be aware of. Anyways, there's the kink. So what are we gonna do? We are going to attach this. I got two posts there. They're concreted into the ground. Unfortunately, if this was straight to that post, I would just pull it back there, but it's not. So I'm going to get me a big, huge strap there. We're going to tighten the strap. Then I'm going to get another strap coming this way, attached to the pumpkin, and then slowly scoot it back. So as we get into this, I will show you the next part. Okay, so there we go. We tightened it up super tight. Now we are got to go get another one actually be able to pull it back all right so there we go we got it attached there comes here and now my buddy gave me one of these straps really cool straps dude super thick look at that as thick as my thing so it's really soft on the pumpkin we've never damaged one i've actually moved a 14 or 1500 pound pumpkin this way before not with the tar straps this is new this year so i'm gonna give this a try i have two of them Another one over there. Well, the reason is because if you crank this one to where it can't crank anymore, I can, I can add that one on, attach it, and then I can crank it even more. So we'll move that as much as needs to be moved. All right. So slow process. Um, if you watch my videos last year, he does the same sort of thing. He's a little bit different than me. Everybody has their own tools. But the biggest thing is take your freaking time when you're doing this people it's a good problem don't make it a bad problem okay you can see super tight there coming up to the pumpkin here we go straps up there super tight here now it's coming out okay and here we go she's moving she scooted back quite a ways Right there is how much the kink came out. I don't know, I might go one more, I'm debating. I don't like this, but I also can see she's still kinked pretty good here. We're getting there. 